Hey guys, John Martini here. Got a new plugin for you called Batch Exporter, which does exactly what it says. It allows you to export multiple formats out of 3ds Max in one go. As you can see here, I have a lot of the basic, most common formatters here. I plan to extend those over time and add uh, more exporters as available in the 3ds Max native export dialog. So one neat feature here is, let's say for example, you wanted to export FBX. What you can do is add another exporter, which when you add another exporter, it will default to being enabled. And then what you can do is actually change the settings between them. So let's say for this FBX one, we wanted to do, uh, you know, Y up, no cameras, uh, don't convert to TIFFs, and we'll close that and open the other FBX. And maybe for this one, let's do uh, with cameras and let's do no lights. So you can kind of change the settings per export. Now to differentiate them, you can add a suffix to the file name. So we'll say uh, option one, hit okay. And we'll do option two here. And then let's go ahead and export out Olympic, uh, a native 3ds Max file. And you can click these buttons here to edit the settings of that particular format. And we'll do OBJ. And then you have a bunch of export methods. As seen here, we have file per root layer combining nested layers. So what that means is it's going to go through and export all the top level layers, including their nested layers. So in this case, we would get an export just for the bedroom layer. Everything below it would be uh, combined into just the bedroom layer. Now, if we do file per layer, that's pretty self-explanatory. It will go through every single layer individually and export that out. We do have a file per selected object. So you can go through and select what objects you would like to export for each format. Then we have a single file per the entire scene, uh, a single file per selected object, and then, or for selected objects. So it, you can select, say, these two planners and it'll export those as one file for every format instead of individually every selected object. So that's the difference between this one and this one. Lastly, we have file per selected layer combining the nested layers. So what that means, you can export the selected layers that you pick by selecting them over here. The last thing you gotta do is select your output directory, which by default, it will go to your 3ds Max export folder and it defaults to adding batch to the end of it. So then you just hit, um, well, let's go ahead and do per layer. We'll go ahead and hit export. And I'll run through every format. Now that the publishing is done, you can open your export folder and you can see we have a file for every layer exported. We do have our options for the FBX and yeah, there you go. Check it out. If you guys have any feedback, let me know. Thanks.